<laughs> I mean, I have an A. That, okay, that's an A card. It's not A plus. It's actually B. It doesn't have any performance parts. But the target tier is A plus. Okay. Dude, why did it bounce so weirdly? <laughs> yeah, I think I wanna I wanna have my Exigement. I think that's gonna be my A plus car. So the question is, do I wanna spend my money on the super garage? If I do, I can buy super parts instead of pro parts. The thing is, the pro parts alone will easily put me, easily put me into A+. I want high rating A+. You know what? If I need more money, I'll make more money. Upgrade. You know what I don't understand? The road suspension gives me the same performance. It doesn't matter if it's silver or gold, you see this? Okay. I'm gonna save up some money, buy the turbo, and then it's gonna be a 2.6... Yeah, it's gonna be a 2.66... Uh, 2.68 actually, I can just put in the turbo charger. We have new opponents! No! Oh, oh god. Thanks. <laughs> Just TTR is still in here. Oh, that's a Corvette. That's the C8. I was like, it kind of looks like a Ferrari, but obviously the game doesn't have Ferraris. On the fucking Civic. Ooh, a Testarossa. There's Ferrari in this game. That is the Euros? Holy shit. I did not recognize that. That's a Lamborghini Euros. No way, dude. I could not tell. I actually want to take down a few more cops. Okay, what does a roadblock look like? Wait, actually roadblocks? With cops? <laughs> Shit, that just took a lot of damage. Okay. I didn't take damage. I don't think you take damage. Or maybe? Maybe only a little bit? From jumping into the water? Okay. I will use it. I will use it and there's nothing you can do to stop me. <laughs> For the most messed up defender I've ever seen in my life. That, that, that hurt him a lot more than it hurt me. I'm fairly certain that this car by default is a drifty one. <laughs> well, heavy car means heavy damage. The story, I would say, is less of a focus point in this game than it was in Heat. But the gameplay is better. And that is definitely the right focus for me. Right, the gameplay being more relevant than the story was good for this game. Oh shit, already? How are we already at heat level 5? We're still during the day, man. Oh god, we're actually in the chase too. I'm in a heat level 5 chase with an A car. Oh, there's a roadblock too. <gasps> Ouch. But I'm escaping too. Hey, <laughs> our first successful level 5 escape. Okay, if I turn off my engine by holding the B button, I should escape faster. Is it really faster? So, the red symbol means big money. That is not big money. <laughs> 2,000 in, 5,000 out. That is actually not good. Cash needed. Oh shit, I can enter this right now. Actually, oh fuck. Yeah. I have to do, I have to do one of these first because I have no money. <laughs> See, that's the thing with the buy-in. If you forget that you have buy-ins, you spend too much money. You have to go for the free events. It's over there. 4,000 in, 12,000 out. Okay. We're gonna do this one first. My A car and then do this one. It's, it's such an interesting gameplay mechanic. You always have to keep a little bit of money just so you can buy in. Right Sell down. the Why I is there a cop on me immediately? So what do you mean? There. The chopper right. knew where my hideout was. Bullshit. <laughs> Get him. That was a nice turn. <laughs> Escape artist. The thing is, as long as we have the chopper on us, I don't really have... Nice, put him into the wall. Ah! Also, you can turn off your engine. Shit, 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 shit. That's, uh... I think... I know what it is. I need... I need... I need to go. I need to go. No! <laughs> Leave me be! Oh, that's a rock wall. <laughs> I was hoping I'm gonna jump onto the mountain and escape, but no. The slowdown off-road is a lot less than it used to be in the old games. Don't break your car. Scan the streets. Find this punk. I'm gone. Nobody knows where I am. I'm so close. This fucking jump freaking away from me. <laughs> The good thing is if I do a car delivery now, means I don't need to use my car, which has a lot of heat and is about to die. Monkers. 
yeah, the heat, the, the chases are a lot more balanced and just a lot more interesting too. It's true that there were times in heat where I really enjoyed the cops too, but once you figured out the cops in heat, they they lost their appeal very quickly. I actually don't think this is going to be the case here. I bet her car has less heat than my car does. Oh wait, never mind. I need to pick her up. I drive her in my car. Paid in full. Avoid the cops. Level 5. Oops. You know, in the city, in my opinion, it's easier to escape because you fake, you fake for uh, going to a certain spot and then you have like a nice drift and you're in a completely different... Oh. Okay, let's figure out <laughs> if the tires are reinflating in this game or not. They are, okay. I love how I went like left first and then right. Can I drive here? Ah! So much damage, man! Okay. This does not look good, boys. I'm 100% hiding myself in a meetup spot if I break the line of sight with the cops. Ah, it's still there on me. I need a faster car. I love how they still have voice lines ready for this. So there's not limited amount of repairs, but there's a time limit. Like, you have to wait four minutes until you can repair again. If you escape, you can repair immediately. I cannot believe I survived this. <laughs> yes! And you did. You know, you know what I see in this game? They actually listen to the feedback. They listen to the complaints, found them valid, and improved it in this game. This is really this is what I wanted, man. I wanted a better version of Heat, and it it really is. Hey guys, Sakura here. Check out Instant Gaming for cheap game keys. Click the link in the description below. Oh, this is interesting. There are some head-to-head -head events out there. That is. Chance to earn some stacks. See, this makes sense. Two people pay six thousand, and you get twelve thousand for winning. Right? That makes sense. <laughs> that zero to one hundred is instant. Oh, this car is so broken, dude. <laughs> I have a plane for a car. <laughs> Escape. This is gonna be a wild card. I'm really curious how strong this one is. This is the most hated car in all of Ghost Need for Speed. Because it was always the most powerful, most broken car. But I love the bumper deletion on this one. Looks sick. <laughs> Dude, somebody please take count of how many cars I crash into the event. You know, after playing around with both handling models, I actually think a hybrid, like a grippy car that can pull off a drift if necessary, might be the fastest way of moving around in this game. The cool thing is you can still do uh, lower performance races, like you don't have to do everything in your fastest car. I like that. And we are all the way back to heat level 5, and I only have a B car. <laughs> Honestly, the little bit of air control is quite important. It's not realistic, but it's actually very helpful. This is the B class. This is the slowest speed class. Yes, this will feel slower. This is slightly faster than a starter car, guys. Shit. I just hit one of my wheels. You know, this car is really good until you have a high speed race on the wall. A high speed race on the highway when top speed becomes necessary. <laughs> nice driving. Wait, she crashed too. <laughs> we DNF'd nearly all of them. This is gonna happen at some point. On the highest difficulty, we nearly DNF'd them all. I got an ultimate merc for you to deliver. Just yes, give me a second. Ooh, the Mercedes AMG GT. Oh, am I right? Of course I'm right. Is that there? Looks like it. I need some help stopping this driver. <laughs> I guess I can't, I guess I can't let the game run, huh? Best thing you can do is oh, my money. <laughs> well, I guess, I guess now we know. Ah, oh, the money is gone. Best busted, busted. <laughs> Looks great. We can win a car now, though. Oh, we get a car and cash. We're actually gonna go positively out of this race. I'm gonna start with this one. I should have paused. Thank you, Watson. Sherlock. Genius. I don't know, I'm not sure what else to call you. I'm not sure, is it A+, plus? okay. In that case, I have to... 
have to swap my car first and then I have to change. I have to change my tune. I, I forgot that I can do it. I don't have to go out there. What, what did I just do? What did I do? No! What am I doing? What did I do? What did I press? Going online. Ah, okay. So I just want to tune this car. Ooh, that might not that might actually not work. Low downforce. It doesn't that in the middle. Upgrade unavailable. Eh? Oh, I upgraded to tier S. I didn't even notice, but I upgraded my car to S. And that's why it didn't work. I think I'm gonna get my heat level anyways. Right? How does the game handle this right now? Because I missed the checkpoint. Okay, I think it reset my it reset my points. Or I should say my multiplier. So this car is not made for drifting, you know, it doesn't have any drift performance parts. So this this might be interesting. And gotta say when they come up with some cool layouts, then this game out is actually not half bad. But I very much recommend you get yourself a drifty car for this. It's gonna be a lot easier to get points. Oh dude, that actually reset my entire multiplier. It's kinda bad. Okay. Oh, so, wait, how close was that? <laughs> I think I just made it in the very last moment. Yeah. <laughs> I won by not even 200 points. <laughs> I'll take it. Now I have the necessary heat level to do the event that I actually wanted to do. What, what, is, the, what is the price? I think for a gallon, right? Well, pre-COVID pre prices, unless that is liters. <laughs> If you pay a liter, <laughs> a liter for 250, 270, 290, that's actually more like COVID pricing. Ooh, we get an Evo 9 from this if we win. And we have three attempts because I have two reset. Wait. Ah, it's this. Oh no, it's this. Ah, shit, my car is not tuned for this. Fucking hell. I forgot it's this event type. My car is not tuned for drifting. Let's give it a try. Maybe I can pull it off. The only thing I can do is, like, make my car... Holy crap. And not lose the multiplier by using NOS. Dude, my car is not tuned for this. I said I lost so many points there. Interesting. Very interesting bounce on that one. Dude, even if I pull the handbrake, the car refuses to drift. So this is what happens when you put make a pure grip build. Is it interesting? That's gonna reset me and take away my multiplier. Uh, yeah, I think that's it though. And I think if we didn't lose the multiplier, this could have worked. I'd rather put money on my grandmother. <laughs> okay, I think I think we can pull this off. I, I think I'm just gonna press the retry button. Okay, fifty thousand for the last lap. I think we can pull it off. Just trying to keep the multiplier alive, especially when there's nothing to hit. How much more do I need? Ah, I think I have it. I think I have it. That was hard. <laughs> that was so hard to do that in a grip car. Dude, does that mean my car is at risk too? Like, not just the money, also the car that I just unlocked? Is both of it at risk? Dude, the cops immediately come for you. Ah, Chopper, no! What can I do? Oh, barely! Barely scraped by. Although it's all-wheel drive, it's probably better for gripping. This is actually probably gonna be better for drifting. Like, I kinda wanna make it my dedicated drifter, but it's still all-wheel drive, you know? <laughs> Let's farm some cop kills. I really like the idea of winning cars instead of buying them. And you can still buy cars if you want to. Okay, 6,000 for a quick time. It doesn't have to be pristine. What I find interesting, drifting seems to be not as grippy as you might want it to be. Like at this point, I am thinking that a hybrid of, you know, a car that can drift if it needs to, but mostly grips, might be the fastest way around this game. Okay, what? Oh shit. Okay, gold, you definitely can crash. Not that it really matters. As far as I've seen, the game does not keep track of your medals. Like, I don't think the game actually will write down that I only got silver instead of gold. The effects are not annoying at all. I don't mind them either. I think it's just something people like to talk about. It's not really a problem, honestly. The hold now, so I tap it. I hold it. I actually have not tested that out, but it seems a bit annoying from a visual standpoint and from an audio <laughs> experience. <laughs> tapping the nostril. <laughs> that's, actually, that's actually an interesting, interesting idea to tap the nostril. <laughs> then have 
if any of wind lands on the screen 24 7. Oh, we wanted to test out what happens if we drown the cops, right? Ah, it still works! <laughs> they actually turned off the damage. You don't take damage anymore when you drive into the water. Holy shit! <laughs> what the fuck just hit me like a train, man? <laughs> I assume it was the SWAT car here. Boom! Banked! Hell yeah, six digits, 136,000 big money. Two more days, there's two more cars to win, a B car and an A car from what I can tell. And then we can win a Grand Victoria. <laughs> can I do it? Hey! <laughs> Finally fast enough to do this. <laughs> Remember the leaked clip? The track mania baby? Ow. See what I meant with like Mega Grip when you activate the yellow boost? Like you need to incorporate that into your build. Especially I'm on full grip and full grip with like the yellow boost is insane. Okay, I gotta say something though. These barriers have a really cheap popping animation, you see what I mean? <laughs> a little bit of nitpicking, okay? <laughs> a little bit of nitpicking. <laughs> okay, it's kind of funny. Wait. Yes, that kind of counted. <laughs> okay, I should have. Where is it? Found that earlier. Like that's the easier way to get down here. <laughs> the easier way to get down here. Out of my way, pickup truck. Look how fast I'm going. I can actually outrun the chopper. Okay. Crash into the safe house. Can I do it? Yes. <laughs> the thing is, this will only work if you have a health bar. Obviously, you take the damage first. So if you don't have enough health, you can't do this. Keep that, keep that in mind, okay? <laughs> oh god! <laughs> One of the most desired cars in the world. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so many collectors are dying of cringe right now, man. Holy moly, man. Imagine being one of the proud owners of the DB5 and then you do this. <laughs> the Horizon 5 was an absolute mess at launch. I'm very surprised how everything works in this game. Like, I have not encountered any major problems. The game crashed exactly one time in my first 15 minutes of playtime. And that was it. I haven't had a single problem. I'm even using the EA app right now, which I assumed to be buggy as hell. <laughs> oh, you're right. I will lose... I will lose in my current car. Shit. I actually might change the difficulty for this event, because I, I do want the car, but I don't want to spend my money right now on a new car. If that makes sense. The Evo is too slow too. I had that, I had that earlier. I could upgrade the Evo. Okay. I'll show you what my problem is. Speedy. I'll show you my problem. I cannot change the difficulty. Are you sure about that? Does it just stay on it? Fuck! That didn't work. Now we lost the night. Yeah, that, that didn't work. I forgot. I forgot when you go back to the garage that it changes the day. Oh well. I should have. I should have known. Well, it's time for the qualifier. We're gonna win the Crown Victoria. <laughs> there is no. There is no going back. All right, we got a sprint race, another sprint race, and another sprint race. <laughs> At some point, you know what I mean. If you play the game long enough, there's gonna be. Oh, that's that's a crash. <laughs> Dude, the cop actually evaded me. I, <laughs> I tried to take him down. Ah, they're evading me. Okay, maybe we don't want to crash into the wall this time. <laughs> Let's, let's be nice to the game. No, I don't think... Wow, look at these loading times. It's fucking instant. I love it. The optimization is clear as day, man. The downtime in between events is so low, which makes for a fantastic flow of the game, you know? That don't really affect the gameplay experience. <laughs> okay, I wanted to try it. When you pull the handbrake and also um, activate the yellow nose, 
insane grip. You probably could have pulled off a 360 circle turn <laughs> with those two combined. Can I do that again? Let's try. Ah, not this time. This time I didn't get up the half pipe. You can drive on the ceiling of the of the pipe, but only temporarily. Like you can't just be on there. It's not a, that infamous F1 grip that keeps you on there. People love betting over stupid drama. That's what's up. <laughs> My post of you and Yaz beefing is blowing up. I am pulling in likes. I am pulling in subs. I am pulling in stats. <laughs> Bet not me. <laughs> it's another well, not Mia. Just you. I never bet on just one horse. She's an undercover cop! Oh, you bet against me? Like I told Rydell, I'm here to win. I forgot, I forgot my character. I got some ideas of how we can get some look. more of that, so... And focus up. I'll hit you up later. Yeah. I hear ya! I mean, I don't agree. Why didn't we get a cutscene? You. <laughs> you know what that is? This is a Ford Crown Victoria. <laughs> or what is left of it. 986 so what I, I can i can make this to an a plus car this is actually more for drifting i could make this into my drift car split true we're done with week two we're in week three now